and block. Bye bye. Activate kill mode. Ah. Welcome back everybody to another episode of Scrap Mechanic and I am here in attempts of making a uh, mech suit. This is the project for today. I've been working on this for, for a couple of hours now. But I can't quite get the walking system quite right. Sorry, give me a second. To engage. Tail. As you can see, the walking is slightly off. Okay, and engage! As you can see, it doesn't really walk. More kind of... Well, then again, it's kind of... Walking. It could be better though. But yeah, now this is what I've been working on. I've been trying to decide that I wanted to make a mech suit. So this is what I've got so far. But I feel like I may be able to. Of course, this thing's walking now. I spent the last like hour or two trying to get this thing to walk, and now it's actually it's walking, but it's walking in the wrong way. Anyway. While I'm doing, while that's walking, I have other features. I have two little arms here, in case we would fall forward, and I also have extenders here, which for some reason, there we go. Wasn't extending for a second there, in case I fell to my side. <laughs> but anyway, that's my walker so far. And that is my first attempt of a mech suit. But yeah, I feel like I can improve on the design here. So I'm going to attempt to make a second one. I feel like I may be able to improve his legs a good chunk. So that's what my goal for today. Is to get these working better. So first of all, I just do that so I can just have the feet. And yeah, we're going to see what we can do here. So, no, I don't want bearings there. I want bearings. I have the ones connecting for the top legs. Yeah, and even for his knees. Okay, so. A bit more work is needed. Haha, <laughs> see what I did there? I'll stop now, but there you go. Um, okay, so we will throw in a couple of blocks here, and I'm gonna throw then these here, this here, this here, and hopefully this be it. Probably won't be. Oh, am I stuck? No, oh, it's kind of stuck there for a second. Okay, and now I just need to. Oh, wrong one. Go to you, and we go hop up here. So yeah, I basically got the mech idea from stealing the legs off the walker. There, I was like, I was looking at the walker, and oh, here actually, it's easier to show than explain. Uh, walker, walker mark tree build. So yeah, when we are actually up and about, and we have this guy moving, you can see the front legs. 
kind of wrong. And then I was just kind of sitting there and was like, I wonder could I make a uh, two-legged walker? I was kind of looking at it like, eh, I probably could make a two-legged one. So then I started messing around and pretty much just took the head off, took the body off like so and took the head off. And then I just worked from pretty much this chunk here. Which is, well, not that chunk. From pretty much kind of like that frame. And, and I worked kind of from to get the legs. But then it was like, yeah, he's too sh I couldn't move with these legs. He was, it was still just too big for him. So it's like, oh, we'll f forget that one and we'll make him shorter. But now I have the issue of they're too short and not strong enough, uh, not long enough to do a walking motion as you saw with my little guy over here. So I'm going to continue on and build. There you fell. Yeah, I'm going to continue on and just see if I can get this guy up and running and. Work from there. Hmm. May have come into a predicament already. Actually, I, I don't think I will have a problem here, if I can get this bit right. And then that should all go on to... Aha! Okay. So yeah, as you can see, this is a, best way to put it, a disaster. <laughs> no, it's not that too bad, but it's, it is confusing as hell. So. I think it's these two. Connect these up. And yeah, we want to do basically the exact same but less power and opposite. So we want you 15, we want you 30, and we want you 15. That should give the motion that I'm thinking will work. Like I'm getting confused as hell out of this now but okay it kind of does but it's more stability now is going to be a big factor so I'm now thinking that these arms may have to be expanded upon okay so So we want to wrong one, not switch. I need a bearing here and here. So now I'm just trying to make it's the best way to put it. Uh, kind of thing. Oh, I'm, I'm just gone blank. What I'm trying to describe here. thing a thing you know the thing that I'm trying to make the thingy thing the thingy thing that things thingy arms I'm trying to make arms that will basically push it back up if it falls to the side so I'm gonna try this out really quick 
Let's see if this kind of works. It does fantastic. If it doesn't, uh, I won't be too upset about it. And more wiring. The wiring is like all over the place, so it's really, really difficult to kind of judge what's what, what's what's, no, what's what. Don't know if that connected. I think I feel like I've disconnected something else now. Oh, I, th I have. There you go. And then we need another button. Yeah, this thing is just covered in buttons. I've kind of just gone a bit crazy. Okay, that's connected and then now we connect you up to you and okay we'll give this a quick go and see does it do what it's supposed to probably not okay so six and seven would help if I actually set these, so we'll just set these to say 135 one of these will be backwards, I don't know which one, we'll figure that out in a second 135 and here we go 6 yeah that's perfect 7, 7 backwards so we just swap oh if I can get out, ah no that one. <laughs> Six, seven. That's okay. Ooh. Oh, I like that as well. It's kind of cool. Okay, so test walk. Here we go. Come on, come on. Ah, oh, so close. I have so many buttons now, it's so confusing to remember which button's which. Oh, I like that as well. Come on. It's still trying to walk. <laughs> but I pretty much screwed this up now. Come on. Uh, push. 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 Okay, well, we've kind of have it working ish okay uh, up up there we go I want to try hiring these up a little bit just to see if this makes it six seven okay so actually if I was to change that we'll just okay so we'll start walking protocol we put these down. Does this make it easier? The wall, it's just the grip. It just seems to have trouble getting any form of grip. So I have a I think I have a solution to that problem as well. well whether this works or not, uh, we we shall see. This could bring in a whole lot of problems on its own. 
So if we got rid of the weird curly toes. Ah, uh, just leave that bit. I'm not too fussy about the mess. I feel like I'm gonna have to replace these with some smaller tubing. So I can fit basically that in. Okay, so this is my plan now. I have rubber wheels for the feet. So let's give it a go. So four and five, six and seven, please lower. It's kind of working. I admit it's not working fantastic. It can it walk on its own without me worrying? Yeah, even the stability of it is slightly better. I'm turning this, I don't know why, because I've no control over the creation any shape or form but yeah we kind of have a somewhat working mech suit should probably change these to switches So if I change those to switches, uh, let's fix this mistake. That's what I meant to get rid of. Disconnecting everything now. Ah, uh, okay, hold on. Ah, uh, damn it. Because I don't even have this saved. Okay, well, we'll worry about that in a second. Seven. We'll disconnect it. That. Seven connected to you, please. Number six connect to you. This is needs to be connected to you. Time to test. Oh well, we have to set this one up first. I can't remember what I set this for. One thirty-five, right? One thirty-five. Test of number that one is okay. Test one, arms down, correct. Test two, systems. 
Six, seven. So I've buggered up which one is not walking right. Number four. Number four is not walking right. Okay. So if I switch number four around, I should be able to remedy this problem. Okay, so if it's problem there's so many controls it's confusing me on which one I'm supposed to be going towards this one I think that's correct once I'll remember not to be standing on this okay so there we go. Okay. Again, it's doing the same thing. It's kind of walking backwards. Tail down. Six and seven activate. It's kind of walking. We kind of have a mech suit. I meant it's not. Oh, I've turned the wrong one off. It's not super amazing. But we kind of have a working mech suit. And I'm quite proud of our little achievement. So if I can turn it off now, that'd be even better. So yeah, we're going to save you now as the mech suit mark 2. That's not how you spell mech. <laughs> mech suit mark 2. 2 said. And there you go! That is my mech walker today. I've gotten very fond in walkers, so I've been um, messing around a lot. Like this was one of the other ones. This was just me testing out the walking system. But this one is just, I like this. It just keeps going. See, now the idea was that I was going to build these as legs and then build plaf, plaf, bleh, flat platform. <laughs> Can't speak today. And just sit on it and I'd be able to control it. But yeah, I've run into then other issues of hitting you can see how close it comes to your bricks and things this is constantly spinning and yeah it was an ordeal and a half so I'll just turn it off there but yeah then I oh and then this was also just me trying to figure out how to get the mechs walking system kind of right so I was messing with one of the controllers and I found that this is probably like the best system to get like a walking motion is do whatever your thing is so say it was 60 then you just double it in opposite direction and then single again and then it, it works really well as you can see so I was thinking if I ever make a battle bot or something that's a good way of making like you can see, the axe kind of system. So that's what I've been working on at the moment. So yeah, this is just a short little video, I think. We'll find out after I do all the editing. Uh, so yeah, if you liked the video, hit the like button and subscribe. And yeah, I will continue on working on my nice little walker. So I'll see you guys in the next one. And walk. Bye. Activate kill mode. Ah.